We all have, we all fight with it. Even if you say you don't, yep. we've all fought with body Be dysmorphia. Be truthful. Uh, that is a very real thing that I feel like most people deal with. Um, it's something that I still deal with. Like, yeah. um, one of, one of our friends on Instagram, um, I was talking to her the other day and she's like, it's so hard not to see overweight me in this sports bra. And I'm like, but that's not the body that's in the sports bra. Right. The body that's in the sports bra has worked her ass off and has a fucking six pack and looks fantastic. Yep. Don't let that shit fuck with you. Yep. Like that's old. That's old. That's gone. That's history. Like, yep. don't let that shit fucking get into you like I talk to Phil about that sometimes too because he growing up was the quote-unquote fat kid and it's like he's like it's hard to get rid of sometimes and I'm like I know but you can't you can't live in that space anymore that's not who you are the voice in your head can be stifled if you focus on the work Mm -hmm. Um, and I know that that sounds overly simplified but you can quiet that fucking voice in your head while you're doing the work if you need to use the voice in your head as fuel to get you through that workout or get you through that bulk or get you to the next plot point on your path, use it. Yeah. Fuck the voice in your head. It is. It lies to you all the time. 